have arrived at your destination. Oh, we're busy. I, I knew we would be, but not like this. We've got a waiting list. For the waiting list. <laughs> Interesting one today. Peugeot, hot hatch. I'll explain more when we get there. Turn around when it is safe to do so. It is safe to do so. See, this anonymous client says they have a potential dirt monster on their hands, but they want to see if it can be made to handle the asphalt as well. Which sounds a lot like a bet I made with Jay a while back. Not saying it's him, but... Well, if it was, he wouldn't want to be too obvious about it, would he now? Ha! Peugeot 205 TT. All right, Jay, you're on. I'll see your little rally car and raise you a lethal street racer. Right. Bring it back to the shop, but not a scratch, understand? I'd never hear the end of it. Hundred meters, turn right. Turn right. Get the team working, and if anybody asks, mum's the word, eh? Right, it's done. Come on in and see. Four-wheel drive, 800 horsepower, plus chassis stiffening roll bars and reduced weight. I could take the dirt on this thing in the morning and Jay could smoke all comers and tar that night. If we could ever share it, that is. Get sideways. Throw that back end out. Just pretend you're Jay. But with my looks. That's the way you settle a bet, Jay. Great stuff. I'll have to give Jay a call and thank him. Whether it was actually him that put us up to this or not, 
I think we could both learn something from this thing. Have you seen this? There's an Upgrade Heroes fan page. People are on there sharing cars and performance specs, talking about you and me and... Ugh, let's not look at that anymore. Back to work, eh? Nick's job is a Ford. And the client says they've had it forever and they love it to death, but it's getting a little sluggish in its old age. Let's see what we can do. Your eyes peeled. If it's as old as they say, it shouldn't be hard to pick out. Ah, Ford Deluxe. Very nice. No wonder it's slowing down though. Bit long in the tooth. Tell you what, if we do this right, this one ought to look good on the Upgrade Heroes fan page. Now don't break it on the way back, huh? That thing is a genuine antique. At the roundabout, Take the first exit. Turn around when it is safe to do so. about take the first exit meters, turn right. No marks on it. Lovely. I'll get the mechanics to work.
So the client wanted drag race speed and street race handling. Well, their wish is our command. Seven liter supercharged engine, lowered profile, improved performance. So it looks like an old classic, but you're only as old as you feel inside, aren't you? Let's test that straight line speed first, then we'll hit the city. Have a listen to that. This thing sounded good in the 40s, but now... When's the last time you saw an 80-year-old getting around town like that? Lightning, eh? Man, everybody's seen that film. It's a nice feeling, isn't it? Helping a car and its owner recapture their youth. Oh, uh, speaking of recaptured feelings, if you want to take any of these cars out again, just say the word. The clients don't mind at all. Getting some serious high rollers in here now. Uh, don't get me wrong, we can make a hero out of anything and anybody, but... I mean, is it so wrong to want to work in a really nice car every once in a while? Now off you go, and bring me back a Bentley. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Calculating route. In two hundred meters, turn left. In two hundred meters, turn sharp right. Turn sharp right. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Come on! Oh, Bentley Continental GT. We just look at it. Your eyes just sort of slide off it. It's so smooth. Yeah, we can work with this. Come on. Klein says they made a bet with a friend, and now they have to turn their ultimate luxury cruiser into a race car. Well, that was silly of them. In 400 meters, turn right. Turn right.
seems a shame to even tinker with this one, doesn't it? Nah, don't worry. Our mechanics are artists. They've pulled it off. Oh, have they ever pulled it off. Come see. Improved aerodynamics, reduced weight, and a full rear-wheel drive conversion. So it's no less luxurious, but now it can really put down that power. Right, we have to have this ready for the client to make good on their bet. They're racing later today in Ambleside. You can test it out on the way there. What do you think? It's definitely got the speed and the handling. Does it still have the luxury? Aye, looks like it. can handle itself as a proper GT racer now. Wonder who the client made this silly bet with anyway. Hang on. What of whomever they're racing is a client too? That's a bit of a conflict of interest, isn't it? Upgrade Heroes does not take sides. Right, your work is done. I, I might stick around and talk to the client about this bet of theirs. Hey, why do we always have to be racing one another? Can't we all just agree the cars are the real winners? Good, good, you're here. This is it. This is the big one, the one that's going to put upgrade heroes on the map. I, I mean... We're already on the map, but look, just go, I'll explain on the way. Oh, by the way, your pickup, it's a Koenigsegg. Turn around when it is safe to do so. meters turn left went out and bought themselves a Koenigsegg without realising that a hypercar has a few very minor but very specific drawbacks. 
Meet the 2011 Agera. To this day, still one of the fastest production cars on Earth, but with just about enough storage space to pack a toothbrush, if it's one of those many travel ones. Bring it back to the shop, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Enjoy, but not too much. The client's going on a trip and they're desperate for that storage space. And they told us to do whatever it takes. So we're going to. <laughs> it's done. You have to come and see this. We put on a roof rack. No, see, it's actually brilliant because at high speeds with the weight reduced, it also functions as a spoiler. 1,400 horses of cargo transporting power stick into the road. Right, I need you to get it to the client in Broadway quick as you can in perfect condition. You're going to be so happy. In 400 meters, turn right. Turn right. In 400 meters, turn left. Turn left. They can pack in the roof now. Golf bag, tennis bag, skis, surfboards. In 400 meters, turn right. Clothes, books, pots, pans, kitchen sink. In 200 meters, turn left. Turn left.
After this, I think we'll both have to take a break from Upgrade Heroes for a bit. Too much else going on at the festival, and our waiting list is just too long. Hope you enjoyed it. And make sure you come back to visit the team. They're the real heroes after all.